You want this, huh? Ready, buddy? Go get it! Huh? <laughs> what was I thinking? That ball is covered in germy dino pup slobber. Any odd paw news from town? Nope, nothing to report. But I still need to do a sweep through the forest. Well, you better get moving. It's almost time for lunch. Lunch? Oh, I love lunch. Oh, Rot, I said almost lunch, time lunch. for lunch. <laughs> 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 Yummy. <laughs> whoop, whoop, whoop. Watch out for the trees. <laughs> uh -huh. Woo. Uh, pardon me, ma'am, but aren't you forgetting something? Me? Forgetting something? I don't think so. Was I hopping too fast? Oh, yeah. Well, the thing is, I, uh, I can't seem to find the helmet Billy gave me. You lost your helmet? Yeah. I'm being very <gasps> sick. Oh, oh. oh, no. Nova to Billy. Come in, Billy. Nova to Billy. Nova to Billy. Billy here. Everything okay, Nova? Not really. I've got an odd pod down in the forest. Sending the location now. Got it. And Billy, uh, we're gonna need the opulence. This odd pod's too big for the odd buggy. Roger that, Nova. Come on, Rox. Lunch is gonna have to wait. Wait? For how long? I'm hungry. <laughs> Here! There! I see them! She hid her head on a low branch on the path. She wasn't wearing her helmet because she lost it. Otis, go. Half kangaroo, half giraffe. This odd paw is our friend, Kangaraff. Strong heartbeat. That's a good sign. Kangaraff, can you hear me? Billy, is that you? Oh, my head. It's tricky being an odd paw with such a long neck, huh? Those low branches can come out of nowhere. Now your eye will be fine with an ice pack, but that cut is going to need to be treated. Can I help you with that? Oh, yes, please. Rox, can you please grab a blanket from the Odbulance so we can keep Kangaraff nice and warm? I'm on it. And Nova. Can you help me hold her head really still? This might sting just a tiny bit. Well done, Kangaraff. Hmm. That doesn't look right. We better get Kangaraff back to the clinic. I'm a bit worried about her swollen tummy. <sighs> back to the clinic and back to my sandwich. Dino five. Nice manners, Rox. Who, hmm. me? <laughs> Thanks. <sighs> wow. Uh, did you say that you lost your helmet? Yeah, hopefully it will turn up. I've looked everywhere for it. Not everywhere. There it is. Now I remember. I put it someplace I would never forget. But then, well... I forgot. Well, it'll work better on your head than in your pouch. <laughs> you're probably right. Sounds like you're hungry. I'm sure Rox would share a bit of his sandwich. <sighs> <sighs> I could make another one. 
<laughs> we've saved every oddball we've ever met. Way to go, Billy, the oddball vet. <sighs> nope, nothing up there. Oh, my stomach is so empty. I'm so, so, so hungry. I wish I had a <gasps> honey. <laughs> Jackpot! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Whoa! A ferret! Half bear, half parrot! And half beehive? Uh, you need some help there. Oh, so sorry about that. I didn't mean to sting you. Although, I am going to have to ask you for that hive back. It is our house, you know. Don't worry, we're on it. Billy, do you copy? We've got an odd paw in need of help. Read you loud and clear, Nova. What's wrong? We've got a ferret with a bee sting. And a beehive on his head. Yikes. All right, Nova, we're on our way. An odd paw needs help. This jump for Billy! out of that beehive in no time. Um, yeah, whatever you said. This way. Nope. And now in you go. Into the opulence. Please bring it back in one piece. The other bees will be very upset if their house gets damaged. Don't worry, we'll be back soon. Okay, let's bring in our odd pot patient. Yeah. <laughs> I did not sign up for a workout. <laughs> right. First things first, we need a little smidge of ointment for that bee sting. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm on it. She said a smidge rocks. There. Feeling better? Oh, much better. <laughs> and now the trickier part, getting that beehive off your head. <laughs> yep, that's wedged on pretty tight. We're gonna have to be super careful so we don't damage the hive. <laughs> it's no good. The honey is too sticky. And too delicious. Fox, you're drooling everywhere. Like always. Wait, that's it. We need to make him drool. Then the beehive will slide right off. You know, with this honey, we can make some delicious flapjacks. Flapjacks? <gasps> and some honey glazed carrots. Honey glazed carrots? And a big honeycomb banana split sundae. <laughs> banana split sundae? Uh, ooh, ooh, and um, uh, spaghetti with honey. Uh, <sighs> it's working! It's working! I'm gonna pull off the slobbery beehive now. <laughs> We did it! <laughs> I'm free! <laughs> now, where are those honey glazed carrots? <laughs> <laughs> Here you go, Queen Bee. Good as new. And without a ferret hanging off it. <laughs> Wonderful! The other bees will be so pleased. And this is for you. Your very own jar of honey. 
for the next time you're feeling a little peckish, hmm? Peckish? <coughs> Thanks, your royal queenness. And sorry for all the trouble. And thank you guys. You make me feel all better. We've saved every odd paw we've ever met. Way to go, Billy, the odd paw vet. <gasps> okay, a little help. <laughs> Did you hear that rumbling, Rox? Uh, <laughs> I only had time for two breakfasts. My tummy's still hungry. Not your tummy. Something is shaking the ground. Yummy leaves are my favorite! <laughs> See? I told you! It's not your tummy! No! But that is... Trouble. I thought I heard something too, but it was probably Roxas' tummy again. He does love his treats. Mm. Can I try a bite? Of course. <laughs> it's a floating head. All rocks? What is... Hello! Oh. Uh, hello? Are you okay? Well, not really. I'm a little tied up. Quick, Nova, rocks, grab that vine before it snaps! Whoa! <laughs> 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 Splinter's gonna have to come out. And we'll need to do some tests to make sure her head is okay. Come on, let's get you to the care clinic so we can get you all fixed up. The scanner will help me take a closer look at Kangaraffe's head. Well, thankfully your head is just fine. But there is one thing left to do. I'll pull out that splinter with some tweezers. Hmm, Daddy? You got this. Daddy? Be brave. Three, two... Got it! Yay! Wow! I didn't even feel a thing, Billy! Good. Now, just promise that you'll watch where you're going in the forest from now on. 
Gotta be careful with that long neck. You got it. Oh. Ouchie. Let's get some ice on that bum. And a plaster. <laughs> and maybe you should also have one of these. <laughs> we've saved every odd paw we've ever met. Way to go, Billy, the odd paw vet. Oh, wow, this is incredible. Rocks. It was just an accident. We just need to grab the. <laughs> Good boy, Rocks. See, what would I do without you? <laughs> <laughs> we really should do something. <laughs> About those pickups. Come with me, Rocks. Nova to Billy in the care clinic. Billy, hello. Hello. <laughs> Rocks, did you read the radio again? Hello? Uh. Hmm. It's not like Billy to be away from her radio. Well, at least there's no trouble to report. Ah! Uh, wait! Was that Odd Paw flying and asleep? Flying. Hm? Send us your exact location, Nova. We're on our way. An odd paw needs help. Better get set. This jump's for Billy. <laughs> Billy the odd paw gets. Follow that. Beauty Kitty! Oh no! They're back! Hang in there! Billy will be here any second! Billy! Any second! Hmm, that's getting less fun. Flying and sleeping. That's so dangerous. That's true, Rox. But the parrot part of him wants to fly. And the bear part needs to sleep through the winter. Sometimes odd paws just get a little mixed up. Ah! I know, buddy. Can you be brave while we make sure nothing else hurts? What? Be brave. Say, ah. Say, ah. Hmm, let's see. Oh, well done, Barrett. I think it's just your wing. Let's get you back to the care clinic so we can make sure. Huh, this odd paw can really sleep. <laughs> he really can. I've never seen anything like it. Wait, wait, wait. Did we just agree on something? Hm. Don't 
be silly. Phew, <laughs> <laughs> the wing is just bruised. I'm gonna bandage it and then keep him in the care clinic for a few days to rest. Whew. He really can sleep through any... <laughs> My hiccups are finally gone! Thanks, buddy. We've saved every odd paw we've ever met! Way to go, Billy, the odd paw vet! Coming in for a milk break. We'll have it ready for you. Uh, whoopsie. <laughs> uh, Hold that milk, Billy. We might have trouble after all. <sighs> Thank you. Oh, uh, Billy. What do you know about talking turtle shells? An odd paw needs help. Better get set. This jump for Billy. <laughs> Billy the odd paw. Turtle duck to unstuck. Get it, rocks. Duck to unstuck. Rocks. Oh, <laughs> who's a cute widow egg? Nova, you want to help me while rocks babysits the egg? I could, but then who's going to babysit for rocks? <laughs> well, I guess I'm flying solo. Hello, my name's Billy, and I'm here to help. What's your name? <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> okay, if I have a look inside your shell. <laughs> Thank you. Otisco. <laughs> Sounds like you're really stuck. Are you feeling okay in there? I'm okay. Just embarrassed and worried about my egg. No need to be embarrassed. These things happen. And your egg is in excellent paws. Well, four of them, actually. Ooh, the egg is hatching! <sighs> False alarm, but we'd better get you back to the clinic and out of your shell before your baby hatches. <sighs> She's really sick. Stuck in there. Right, team? Uh, team? <laughs> what are you doing in there? <laughs> oh. Oh. <sighs> okay, Dirtle, I'm gonna try to pull you out now. Try to relax. Okay. Uh, sorry, I can't hear you right now. But I almost. Yes, I see that now. Don't worry, we'll figure this out. This grease should loosen things up. than I expected. Mind if I borrow that feather? 
turtle. I'm gonna try something a little odd. Maybe I can tickle you out with this feather. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> it's catching. <laughs> Thank you all. If not for you, I'd have missed my baby's hatching. We've saved every odd paw we've ever met. Way to go, Billy, the odd paw vet. We're also available for babysitting. <laughs> <laughs>